Marines and sailors from combat logistics regiments 35 and 37 participated in Fuji Warrior, a field training exercise from June 6th to June 20th at Camp Fuji. In preparation for the final training module of the exercise, the Marines geared up, passed out ammunition, and began their 10-kilometer hike through rocky, ashy terrain at the base of Mount Fuji. Over the course of the two days, the Marines would be conducting military operations in an urban terrain at a simulated city called Mount Town. What the Marines have been doing today, they start out at their assembly area where they would gather into a 360 security perimeter send out their uh, recon teams, team recons, go out there and see, look at the village that they're getting ready to come upon, or city, whatever objective that might be. You know, what they're seeing, who's walking around, what kind of machine guns they see, you know, is there civilians there, or what kind of trucks. And then they come back and uh, brief their team leaders and their platoon commanders and platoon sergeants. So when, then when they do, they do come onto the city, they know what they're gonna be facing once they uh, enter the city. After reconnaissance had been made, it was decided that 1st Platoon would travel along a tank trail and attack Building 3 from the northeast, while 2nd Platoon would push through the forest to the south and capture Building 1. Urban fighting is, uh, is what we teach at Mount Town. It's something that we have used since uh, Seoul, Korea, then Hue City in Vietnam, and then as recently as uh, Fallujah. Uh, so it's something that Marines have to be ready for because it's, it's something that Occasionally we will, have to, uh, we will have to fight in an urban environment and uh, this is a pretty big chance for them to get some practice and, and experience some of the chaos. Once the Marines were in position, it was time to engage. Even with adrenaline pumping and the chaotic environment, each person relied on the Marine to their left and right. There was only ammo that I knew coming out here, and now I know everybody in 2nd Platoon uh, pretty well, actually. And we got to work together, patrol together, clear houses together. Even though ammo wasn't working together all the time, we were always communicating and uh, pushing through whatever our mission was at the time. Overall picture I see for Fuji Warriors, bringing those non-infantry MOSs you know, together. Because like I've said before, the, the, the commands are going to get a better Marine back, a better NCO, you know, because what those NCOs can do, what any Marine here can do that's been through the training, can go back to their unit, you know, small, small unit leadership, and teach the Marines that did not come out here the tactics you know, and, and stuff we did out here. Once the town was secure, the Marines and sailors patrolled through the night. They had completed the last chapter of Fuji Warrior. Reporting from Combined Arms Training Center, Camp Fuji, Shizuoka, Japan, I'm Lance Corporal, West Loco.